Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm going to make a quick tutorial on how to get flawless widescreen working on 5M in 2022. I've seen some people having problems of getting it running on 5M. I've been seeing an injection error and I had that myself. So I figured out a way to get past that. And ever since I've done this, it's been working. So first what I did is of course I went to my 5M application data and then you go to data and here you're going to want to delete your cache your server cache prive and server cache don't delete game storage or nui storage because then you'll have to i think reinstall the game and so what you'll i already did it so i don't feel like deleting this again because then i'll have to go in and restart and re-download all the assets of the server that i'm in so you would hit delete and once that deletes that's pretty much what does the fix for uh, flawless widescreen. So on flawless widescreen side, what you want to do is go to your program files, 86, find flawless widescreen. Then you're going to go to plugin cache, FWS underscore plugins, modules. You're going to scroll down until you find GTA V, or if that's the only one you have, then open GTA 5. And you're going to open dependencies, scripts, and open up GTA 5 Lua. So on line 31, process underscore window name, this will more than likely say GTA 5 for you. You're going to want to type in 5M, exactly how it is spelled, the executable. And then you're going to want to type it in on line 33, 5M.exe, just how it's typed here. And when you're done, you're going to want to hit file and save. And then once that is saved, you're going to open up flawless widescreen and what you're going to want to do is hit check for updates twice and reload plugins and click on gta 5 it'll open this window i already have mine open since i'm in game but that's what it will do for you as you can see it's fully working it read it found 5m as the sub process and make sure that everything on here is checked exactly as mine on your flawless widescreen okay and you can adjust these as you're liking so i'll jump into game and show you oh whenever you have fix enabled and before you open grand theft auto before you open 5m make sure to minimize flawless widescreen don't open it just minimize it and then launch 5m and here in game you'll see that it's working the third person is further the first person is also working as well and if you get into the car, you can see that it is working. Fully working. I can restore flawless widescreen and show you that it's working in the car. It zooms in, zooms out. So yeah, there you go. That's fully working. Uh, I'll leave a link down below to flawless widescreen if you don't have it. And if you need any help through finding... Uh, the GTA 5 file in your program files for flawless widescreen just leave a comment down below and I'll try to get to it and I hope this video helps you thank you for watching